What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, ooh, it's gonna be an exciting one. I'm just warning you right here, right now. We are battling six different Instagram brands scrunch butt leggings, specifically scrunch butts. We are pitting them against each other, testing and trying them out, seeing who in fact has the best scrunch. I feel like recently, scrunch butts have taken over the legging game. I don't know about you, but I'm starting to feel like it's a super necessity for me in everyday life now. All right guys, so before we hop into checking out these leggings, do not forget to hit that subscribe button and follow me on IG for all things fitness because together we got this. So guys, we are taking these leggings to the gym. We are gonna be testing their fit, functionality, and of course the effectiveness of the dang scrunch. But guys, do not get it twisted. This is not a review of the brands as a whole. This is just a review of their individual leggings. Some of these brands aren't even known for scrunch butts or anything like that. It's like just the one legging. So these are just gonna be a review of the leggings as they are. All right, yo, so let's see what Instagram brands we are gonna be checking out today. Yeah, ah. all right, drum roll, please. Woo, we are looking at the Rider Wear Staple Scrunch Bum in Coral. Ooh, so sexy. <laughs> oh yes, you already know the Alphaly Amplify and Mocha had to make its face up in this here video. Oh, we oh. have some bombshell thigh high leggings. Ooh. In the color gray and black camo. Interesting. Oh. oh wow. Okay, so we actually have some VQ up in here. Vanquish. These are the pink radiate vanquish leggings. That's an insane scrunch. OMG. All right, guys, I'm gonna really try my best not to be biased here, but um, yeah, we got the red uh, Gymshark camo, obviously. You gotta add it in, they're my babies. And last but not least, we have the Do You Even Scrunch Seamless in the color teal. <gasps> that band is something else. I can't wait to try you on, yeah. First brand, Do You Even. Do you even know how cute these look right now? <laughs> so I'm not gonna lie, the second I put these leggings on, I heard nothing but like snapping all throughout the crotchal region. Right on that scrunch, that scrunch was snapping, snap, crackle, pop, like I was in the Rice Krispie Tree factory. That's what it felt like. So we got a little issue back here. It's very restrictive, like even going into a little, oh, it's flossing my booty a little bit. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this scrunch is not stretchy but I love the way it makes my glutes look. At the same time, this reminds me of like the Amazon scrunch butts where it's like flattering, but there's no stretch in it. So it's like defeats the purpose of being able to wear it to a gym. It's a little bit upsetting because I'm not gonna lie, I was looking forward to these leggings. I love this teal color. I think it's so beautiful for this summertime. The length is great. Ugh. Just the overall look in this band, let me tell you. The scrunch has a slight wrinkliness to it, so you can tell from far away that it, you're wearing a freaking scrunch butt. There's no denying it. Don't try to conceal that. The world's gonna pretty much know what you're doing here. I know that these will look good for a nice gym selfie. Like, take a look at these glutes, bae. They're pretty popping, not gonna lie. Do you even's got it going on with that? It's not very comfortable in squatting. These feel identical to my Amazon scrunch butts, like to a T. The scrunch goes all the way down to the gusset. So it's connected. So as I'm squatting, it's just pulling on the gusset and it just feels like somebody's taking a nice floss and just doing the damn thing to it. I need that stretch, son. Really, like we need a stretch when we're trying to freaking get it down and dirty in a squat. The band is a really nice compression. It like kind of snatches my waist. And yeah, totally squat proof. So no gape in the band, like the fit's all right. I feel like I'm really popping back there. And the curvature, like the really nice gentle contour, everything is so super flattering and it's working. We just need some movement in that scrunch. I think then it would be pretty perfect of a scrunch butt because it's, it's there. Woo, woo, oh, bombshell. I feel like a bombshell. I'm gonna go ahead and say this right here, right now. If you got a thick, thick booty area, God bless you, girl. These leggings are for you. I, however, don't got it like that. So the scrunch butt, um, <laughs> it starts where my like top of my glute, like right here, 
This is where the top of my crack is, <laughs> and then the scrunch is up here. <laughs> Small booty problems, you know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, for my thicky girls, um, bombshell is totally meant for you. Like, I can feel it right now. And if you're especially taller, like I'm five foot three, these are pretty long on me. So if you're taller, these will work for you. I love the pattern though. You got camel with the thigh high, looks like I'm wearing thigh high socks. This is all mesh down here. This is freaking awesome, super breathable. And the camo is so buttery soft. It feels really luxurious. Like I can't stop touching it. Oh, even though these aren't seamless, they don't have a front seam. So I'm very grateful for that. There's no camel toe at all. These are really just like a thick girl's dream right here. <laughs> I gotta grow some glutes and then maybe, maybe I'll fit into these. But um, they got something going on here, the scrunch. Even it being super high, still looks flattering on the glutes. What do you think, Beck? Looks it's very nice. flattering. Kind of helps to like tuck it up into the cheeks a little bit. So. Hell yeah. Yeah, the fabric's kind of working its way up there. It's mm. doing the job. With this particular pattern, the scrunch is very discreet. So if you're somebody who doesn't want it to be super noticeable that you're wearing a scrunch butt, then this is something to consider. From far away, it could make my glutes really look that big, but they're not. So, haha, -ha, I'm gonna trick everybody. Everything seems pretty comfortable. I'm not gonna lie, it's comfortable. I feel the seams here on my quads. So that's the only thing that like feels a little weird when I'm squatting down is you can feel like the seams. But the scrunch is really comfortable. Nothing's uncomfortable. <laughs> and of course it's super squat proof, so that's a plus. But yeah, I think, um, I think this would be a perfect 10 if I could just grow those glutes a little better. Fill them out a little bit, I don't know. Oh yeah, and fun fact, this is actually my first time ever trying bombshell, so um, first impression, I'm pretty freaking impressed, not gonna lie. Nice job, bombshell. All right guys, so if you've been subscribed to me for some time now, it's most likely for my Gymshark videos. I'm just gonna go take a stab in the dark. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna talk about the Gymshark camo right now. We all know that Gymshark has multiple types of scrunch butt leggings, all right? You got that Whitney. We got the power collection. Like there's a lot of different scrunches, but I'm going with the camo because it's the most known. It's, it's got a wide variety of different legging colors and things like that. I'm wearing the red ones today. Love this fire red. Straight up, I love Gymshark's camo legging. In general, it's freaking bomb diggity dog. The scrunch on the camo is not like any other brand that I've seen. It's only about that big. It's a few inches rather than the whole bum. It is noticeable, like from far away, I do believe you could see it, especially when you squat, like you can see that there's a little stitching over here, a little bit of that scrunch action. It's not that overly wrinkly look around the glutes, it's just a subtle little patch, if you will. I feel like it's subtle in such a way where it only kind of helps like the upper part of my booty, and then the rest is just done by my the bottom of my glutes, like it'll tuck it up. I always say that it helps you where you need it the most, where I don't know about you, but my booty kind of thins out on top and will not grab material up here at all. So I feel like it kind of fills that void for me. So yeah, this is why I love the Gymshark scrunch. It's subtle, but yet just helps you where you need it up here. Cause I'll tell you girl, I got like nothing up here. My booty cheeks ain't massive up here. They just don't want to grab at that material. These have been my go-to leg day leggings for a couple years now. Pretty much the second I got into Gymshark, like these were my staple leggings for leg day. I think a lot of you can relate to that, right? Hands up if you agree. It just does what you need it to do and the durability behind the leggings. Like this is why I just think they are fire for just getting the job done. They are completely squat proof. And for me, I know the scrunch doesn't get in the way at all. It doesn't feel like a scrunch. There's nothing riding up your glutes. There's just no restriction whatsoever. It just kind of flows with you and allows you to move freely. It's classy. So do you guys remember in the beginning of this video when I said that these leggings are not a reflection on the brand themselves? But guys, do not get it twisted. This is not a review of the brands as a whole. Well, this is why. So Vanquish's scrunch, a legging is, um, how do I say, not the very best of first impressions straight up off the bat. I never tried Vanquish before and I'm really like upset because I've heard really great things, but right now, this, this scrunch is, must not be one of them. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry. Straight away when we, no. Straight away when we took them out of the package, Bay actually noticed 
a little stain on the back area. So I don't know if somebody like let one loose and then returned it. Don't really know what uh, went on with that, but. So yeah, they came in dirty, so strike one, right? Pretty color. All right, pale pink is cute. The mesh breakup is a nice addition, I think. Even though there's a front seam, there's no camel toe, which is great, but then again, it's kind of like loose as hell, so I think I need to size down in these. They are feather light, so they got on me really nicely, but they're really slippery. Like, I could feel it as I'm moving. Like, I feel things shifting around a little bit. The thing that gets me, though, oh, there you best zoom up in here. You gotta zoom in on the scrunch. It literally just lays over my glutes, like, as if nothing happened. Like, if there was no wrinkly scrunch, it would just be one big fat uni butt. There is no tucking in of the material. It's just an overlay. There's no cinching in around the glutes. It's a completely like pointless scrunch butt. Like I don't, it's not doing a single thing but looking ridiculous on me right now. The wrinkles just go all the way across my buttock. So it's extremely noticeable of a scrunch, but it's just, it's missing the elements that make scrunch butts scrunch butts. Like it isn't, the material just isn't working inward and it's not tucking in material inside the glutes. It's not even touching my glutes. It's like glute repellent. And on a side note, like it's not cellulite friendly. I gotta make mention of that because I see nothing but my cellulite in certain lighting. Uh, but yeah, man, it's um, it's fucking nuts. <laughs> I do feel like if I size down, it might be like that much better, but I just don't see how it would magically just like make the scrunch just work because I don't feel like the scrunch is working at all in any way, shape, or form. Like, it just doesn't feel like it's doing a damn thing. It's an eyesore. Yeah. If anything, it's just like uh, an eyesore. You're better off with just a regular seam at this point. But again, guys, if you love Vanquish, again, this is just my first impression of these leggings. I'll definitely give their other leggings a check. So if you happen to like one of their leggings, comment down below so I can check them out next. You never know. This could just be a fluke. So they seem pretty squat proof. That's what's up, but um, they're not functional whatsoever for me. I cannot vibe with them. They're, they feel like they're falling down. Very baggy, if anything, size down, but I just don't see it. I don't see it like working still. I don't see, I don't see the, I don't see the light at the end of this tunnel. Just like that, my confidence is back. So guys, if you saw a couple weeks ago, no, maybe like a week ago, I did an Alpha Elite Amplify try on for the first time ever, and I was obsessed. So um, nothing changed. I still love them to death. You guys were right. Like I took your word for it and y'all didn't let me down. The Amplify is just, it's really special. Okay. It is unlike any other legging I've ever tried on. I do believe that. It is lightweight. It is breathable. It goes on like a stocking. And also you guys were right. It wasn't too long. If you shimmy it up, it just works somehow. Look at this. It looks like my normal seven eights now. I love the overall fit of the band. It just, everything lays over your curves so spectacularly, especially that scrunch. It, they do the damn thing with that scrunch right <laughs> What's unique about their scrunch is it's like nearly invisible. Like I don't notice it, especially when you do the whole posing, your blue pose, you don't see it. Like it's not wrinkles coming out. It's just so tucked inside your booty that it's not even recognizable that it's a scrunch. It looks like your glutes are just naturally doing it and I, I can't get enough of it. When squatting down, like deep squat, you can kind of feel like the actual scrunch like tucked away inside of your glutes, but it's not to an uncomfortable extent like the do you even. This actually ends right before it touches the gusset, so it's not pulling on the gusset and like riding you up like that. You know what I mean? This actually ends right before, so as you're squatting, there's room to just kind of move. There's, it's not restricting one thing. This overall scrunch look just kinda looks like my body was painted with mocha colored brown paint. So this color in particular is pretty squat proof. I know there are other ones like the light yellow I tried on, not really at all. <laughs> so keep that in mind, they are known like for their Amplify now. So scrunch is their game and you could tell like they're specializing in it. You could tell by wearing it. So just keep that in mind, they're lighter colors. Not totally squat proof, but this one works for me in every area that I need it to work in. Okay, last but not least, rider wear. This is not a seamless legging, so it makes it a little bit tricky, and I'm gonna tell you why. Number one, 
I got the dreaded CT. Bad. Number two, the seams here on the band aren't working for my glutes because it's making it look like it's extra tiny. Like this is all the meat that I'm working with. Really, I'd like the seam of the band here to kind of be up here, just to make the glutes look a little bit bigger. I'm trying to make my glutes look as good as I can here, hence the scrunch butt. So if I have a seam cut my booty in half, defeats the purpose. The scrunch itself is a bit dramatic. You can definitely tell you're wearing a scrunch. There's nothing subtle about it. So believe it or not, the seam on the bottom of the band is actually what's rubbing up against my back. So as I'm squatting, I can feel it like somebody's just kind of touching my lower back up and down, just kind of scratching at it. The scrunch itself isn't too bad. Like it doesn't feel uncomfortable. It's just this right where the top of the scrunch meets the seam of the band is irritating my lower back a little bit. So when I'm squatting, it's doing nothing but rubbing and scratching. The amount of material on the scrunch is excessive. Honestly, guys, the seam reminds me of the actual like seam stitching on a football. It even feels like leathery like that. <laughs> The actual seam of the scrunch is like, it's just overbearing, like to the point where I feel it, I feel it too much when I squat. No. All right guys, so it is now that time to conclude today's video. I'm gonna be ranking these, whether they are a pass or a fail, in my personal opinion. Would I wear these? Would I repurchase if I could do it all over again? Things like that, or would I just kind of toss them to the side, return them a little bit, and just uh, never look back? <laughs> in no particular order, Bombshell, well, 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 bombshell. I would definitely rank you, first of all, I, I need to show like how big those quads look. You see that? That's gonna be a big pass for me. They were very flattering, even though I don't feel like I can fill this out to its potential yet. I'm still striving for those gains. And I do believe that with time and patience, I can really like fill these out because I just, Love the overall fit of these. I think they're flattering, they're unique. My girls who got that badunka donk, oh, you would look so good in these leggings. So yeah, they did something right with this. I would give it a go again, and even me not filling it out, it still seemed to look pretty freaking flattering. So I would give these a pass for sure. Okay, when it comes to rider wear, I'm gonna have to fail this one. <sighs> I just couldn't get past that really obnoxious thick seam that just was touching me all over the place and in places where uh, I don't wanna get touched. Unfortunately, uh, I feel like they could use a little work on their scrunch. The camel toe is a little too much for me too, so the seams in general just didn't work for me at all on this legging on top of the scrunch, so um, sorry. Great brand though. I've worked with them in the past and they're wonderful people, so I have, Nothing but good things to say about them in general. They're wonderful, but um, I'm gonna have to pass. Okay, so Gymshark Camo, what do you guys think this is gonna be? I mean, for crying out loud. What you think? Yeah, of course it's a pass. I've loved you for years now, okay? And I want more of you still. Gymshark's the OG when it comes to scrunch butt life, so I am very much connected to this legging right here, and it's never going anywhere in my eyes, never. Do you even? No, you do not. <laughs> Sorry. I'm gonna have to pass on you because as beautiful of a legging as you are and you're seamless, which I freaking love you, I just couldn't get past the restriction when it came to the scrunch. The scrunch just restricted me from life. So I, uh, I can't really find you very functional. Therefore, I wouldn't really be able to train comfortably in you. And I've worn a lot of Do You Even in the past. So I know it's not like a sizing issue. I'm, it's my true size but um, it's just a matter of this actual scrunch that's just not working for me. It's that freaking tight ass scrunch. All right, Alpha Leap, Amplify. <laughs> Do I even need to go into it? I think you know, these are bomb diggity dog. These are one of the best scrunches I've ever tried in my whole life. So yeah, they got it going. They got the recipe right here. So uh, I'm gonna keep rocking these and buy more of these. They're um, definitely a staple piece like when it comes to scrunch. So if you're looking for a really like subtle scrunch, a super light breathable legging, natural looking scrunch, I, um, I have nothing bad to say about this legging, I kid you not. All right, Vanquish, did I save the worst for last? I think I might have. Yeah, definitely a pass on this one. I just, none of this worked for me, but that is just me. I didn't vibe with any aspect of this legging, so I'm gonna have to pass on you. I will try other leggings from this brand. I will. 
I'm gonna give them a fair shot. All right guys, so that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. These are just my opinions, so by all means, take it for what it's worth. Let me know if you guys enjoy these kinds of videos because I'd be more than happy to try other Instagram brands and kind of expand my horizons, try new things, and battle each other a little bit. So definitely drop a comment with a brand that you'd like to see next, and uh, you never know, it might be coming up sooner than you think. Definitely do not forget to subscribe, give this video a like, thank you. I love you all so much, and I'll catch you in my next video.